In this video, I'll show you how to quickly and easily delete rows based on criteria in Excel. So I have a data set over here consisting of a series of names and associated sales numbers for a number of weeks. So what I want to do here is I want to delete all records in which the name in column A is Bill. Obviously, one method to do this is just to go in and manually delete all records that have Bill like this, just by clicking delete. But as you can see, I have a very large data set and doing so will be very time consuming. So how to do this in the most efficient way possible? Doing this is very simple. You just need to follow three simple steps. The first step is going to the ribbon in the data section and applying filters to your data set as so. In the second step, you need to click the drop down in the column that contains the criteria you're looking for. In my case, the criteria is the value in column A being equal to bill. So I'll select bill and bill only as so. And then I'll click on OK. The last step is left clicking on the first value in the filtered range and then clicking on Control Shift and the down arrow simultaneously as so. Then you have to do a right click while this range is selected and then left click on Delete Rows. Now this pop-up appears asking delete entire sheet row and we have to click on OK here and we're all done. And as soon as we clear all the filters, as I'm doing right now, our task is done. That is, all rows which satisfy the criteria have been deleted. In this case, all rows which had bill in column A have been deleted. And that was very easy, very convenient, and we didn't have to go and delete each row one by one anymore. And this method ensures that only the rows that meet your criteria are deleted without the risk of accidentally removing other data. And it's quick, it's efficient, and it doesn't require manual selection of large number of rows. And that's how it's done. Now, if you want to learn how to do the exact same thing, but delete columns which meet certain criteria, make sure you watch my other video on this topic. The link is available in the description box. I hope you found this video useful and got some value out of it. If you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also, if you're new to my channel and you haven't subscribed already, make sure to subscribe and also turn on notifications so you won't miss out on my future videos. See you soon.